ladies and gentlemen, here we are with Modern Warfare 2 Remastered Campaign. Oh, yeah, look at that. There's Soapy Boy. He's ready to go. Fun fact about this game, it didn't work. The game doesn't work when you hit launch on it on PC. You have to do a little workaround involving safe mode and config files and Battle.net IDs. It's very cool. That, that's part of the fun these days with games, you know? You hit play on a game, you never know if it's gonna work or not. The thing you just purchased, you never know if it's gonna function. Whoa, it has an animation now. Ooh, that's fancy. Give me an animation for the grenade. Yes, that's what I call remastered. All right, new knife sound effect. It's a lot more shingier. It sounds like I'm dragging it across a steel surface, which I'm not, it's just air. So weird choice, but I like it. You still got the moves? Oh, we still got the moves. 10 years later, he still got the moves. Impressive. What the heck? Those are some nasty paper plates. They expect me to use that? What? It looks like somebody ate several slices of pizza and spaghetti off those. Whoa! Is that a mobile Burger Town? Oh my god, they got a mobile Burger Town? Okay, this is the best remaster ever. All right, time for the pit, baby. Give me that gun. Shepard, you're going down. I missed twice. Press six to inspect weapon. Oh, it's six. Ooh, hoo -hoo, they added inspections. Uh-oh, that's not good. That's not good. That means when they remaster the multiplayer, it's gonna have CSGO weapon crates. Oh god. Which one has the coolest inspect? That one sucks. Ooh. Oh, that's a cool inspection. Okay. <laughs> We're using the MP5. Veteran recommended. Oh, Call of Duty, you flatter me. No, thank you though. I'm going regular. Your abilities will be tested. <laughs> yeah, sure. Okay, Call of Duty. Whoa, what the heck is this? This is new. Whoa. I'm on a safari. Ah! New content about one minute into the game. All right. I'm gonna enjoy this. I'm shocked that this game was only 20 bucks. Like, honestly, if you own it on Steam, you should get it for free, let's be real. But I fully expected Activision to be like, eh, freaking uh, 50 bucks for the remaster, why not? But no, it's only 20. Now, granted, <laughs> granted, the game didn't work. I had to do a weird, janky workaround with a YouTube tutorial that was like 300 views. So maybe don't buy it, because it doesn't freaking work. But the price is not bad. Ooh, G18, here we go. Give me candy apple, oh yeah. Looking good. Oh, it's got a twirl. It's got a double twirl. Oh, man. See, I just made fun of the inspections like, haha, weapon skins, but <laughs> inspecting your guns does look really cool. It is super fun to do. Twirl and twirl. Bang. That was cool. Now, oh, this crappy, nondescript Middle Eastern school got an upgrade. It used to be very barren, but now they got some books. They got like a cork board. They got a nice drawing of a very happy strawberry. You know, education in these countries is very important. It's very important for the people to get educated. I don't know why they don't focus on education more, honestly. If they, if they just got better schools, they'd be doing way better. Uh, hang on. Die, die. Shoot him up. Blow him up. Yeah, kill him. Anyways, yeah, just, just get some better schools. How hard is it? What could possibly be preventing them from improving their education system? You know, I don't get it. All right, mission one is over. You know what that means. You know what mission is next. I imagine they're just about freezing right now. Here we go. Whoa, he's got a body now. He used to be a floating head. Advanced animation. Whoa. I can see his shoulder. My FOV might be a bit too high. This ice always looked very strange to me in the original, and it, it looks weird now. It looks different, but it still looks weird. It looks like legit upper Arctic ice. Well, as somebody who's never been to the upper Arctic, I'm just gonna say it looks weird. If, you, if you're if you a researcher in the upper Arctic base, watching this on your crappy, like, government Wi-Fi, and there's like a penguin outside, comment below, let me know if this ice looks realistic. Roach, you don't die until the freaking estate mission. You can't kill yourself now. Come on, man. Oh, we put the gog- Whoa, we put his goggles on. That's new. New feature. Oh, the weather outside is frightful. But the ACR is delightful. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. I forgot the next line of let it snow. What is the next line? Weather outside is frightful. Fire is so delightful. Lights are turned way down- Oh, his lights are turned way down low, of course. Okay. When the lights are turned way down low- Oh, the lights don't even get shot out? Come on. They call this crap remastered. They really took advantage of the new snow graphics. This is way snowier than it used to be. In the old one, the graphics are kind of not super good by modern standards, so you can still kind of see where you're going, but this is pretty bad. Ooh, soapy boy. I'm about to steal your kill in HD. Here we go, here we go. Take that. Yeah, he still gets surprised. He still goes, ah! Come on, airplane, blow up. Blow up. Yes, there we go. All right, slide animation, here we go. Yes, just you left, is it? Yeah, just me. Micah, Bill! I just want Micah, Bill! I'm coming for you, Micah! Alright, you know what I gotta do. I gotta go for the leftmost jump. Whoa, oh my god, whoa! McTavish, you weren't going fast enough, man. Alright, left jump, come on! Come on, whoa! 
my head disconnected from my body there. Also, it wouldn't let me go left. I'm pretty sure the jump is more scripted now, as in you can't go all the way to the left and crash into the fuel tank. Kind of lame, but oh well. They must have seen my video of me doing that like five times and said patch that out. I was supposed to remember something. Crap, what was it? I can't believe I forgot. Oh man. What was I? Ah, God. It's on the tip of my tongue. Oh, thanks. Okay. Now I remember. Thanks, Makarov. All right, let's see. They updated the graphics. Are any of these people the same person? Because usually there's like 20 of the same people on the ground here. It looks like they're all the same guy, but they have different clothes on. So that's that's an improvement. Once I get up the escalator in Modern Warfare 3, Yuri's trying to shoot at him. So in theory, Yuri should be down there right about now. Yuri, how's it going, man? Flashbang, Yuri. Oh, <laughs> he's alive. I saved him. Yuri, come on. We got to stop Makarov. Look at his pistol stance. He's holding it so weird. He's like, eh, I'm going to get you, Makarov. I can move him. Oh my God, I can move Yuri. Yuri, you're coming with me. We're going to go stop Makarov. Oh, he's leaving. He's out of here. <laughs> we got to get out of here, Yuri. Oh, what the? Oh, it just kills you? Lame. You blew your cover. <laughs> How? How? How do you know? Uh-oh. It looks like we have a case of the same person syndrome. It's the same lady, too. In Modern Warfare 2 original, it was like the gray jacket lady and the purple lady. They just used her over and over again. And here she is. I wonder if it's a reference. Probably not. Probably just lazy softies. War is delightful to those who have not experienced it. Erasmus. Oh, thanks, Erasmus. Okay, boomer. Oh, jeez. I'm sorry, Makarov. I'm such a klutz. I lost my handgun. Do you know where it is? Can you help me find it? That was no message. Oh, you found it. Thanks, man. Oh, my God. Hey, don't kick me. Dude. Dude. What are you doing? Why does that guy get new animations? Whoa. Different bobblehead. Different bobblehead. That used to be a hula girl. Now it's a random soccer guy. Oh, come on. Where's the gore? Where's the freaking gore? It's just a blood splatter texture. Dude, in the original Modern Warfare 2, that part was freaking brutal. Like, his brain chunks were out there. The favela is so much more colorful now. Check it out, man. It used to be all brown. Check it out. Akimbo. What's the inspection for this? Ooh. Ooh, I like it. Look at this reload. Check this out. Put the shell in. Twirl it. Oh, baby. I'm a sucker for his animations, man. Hey, idiot. Checkmate. So I've been streaming for a while now, and I'm proud to announce that I finally bought something nice for myself on my streaming money. I got myself a nice car. What do you think? Pretty good. Oh my god, soap. Come on. I just paid that thing off. Soap is supposed to clean cars, not destroy them. Hey, oh, good joke. That's, a be <laughs> that's better than my joke. Dang it. Look, I'm the streamer around here. I make the jokes. Just be in chat. Do some freaking pog champs and shut up, you know? Don't come to my stream and show off and do better than me at my own game. This part is so awesome, dude. The freaking Russian invasion of US. This is so cool. More games need to do this. Like Homefront did it, but Homefront sucked. I want another AAA giant budget game to do another campaign like this. Remember what we're fighting for, boys. We're fighting for our clip art wives at home. Is that Tally's Aura Voss Normandy? Oh no, <laughs> Bioware. I didn't mean it, Bioware. It was your, your tally reveal was good. Tally's reveal was re really good and well done. All right, here we go. Let's investigate the gas station. What do we got for sale? Ooh, Mitch's Root Brew Diet. Gotta get some of that. Whoa. They got big thirsty cola from Mitch's well? Dude, Mitch is doing pretty good in this universe. They got ice cream. Oh, no ice cream, though. Come on, I wanted some ice cream. Dude, there was a gas station by my old job that had one of these things for just Dippin' Dots. And then I used to always stop there and get Dippin' Dots on the way home because freaking Dippin' Dots are great. It was like $5 for not that much, but it was worth it because they're Dippin' Dots. But then one day I went in there and there was no Dippin' Dots in there. There was regular ice cream. I was like, where's the Dippin' Dots? And the guy's like, oh yeah, the Dippin' Dots weren't selling very well. So he put regular ice cream in there and said, I was like, what? No. And I never stopped there again. It was, a, it was, it was like this much Dippin' Dots for five bucks though. It was kind of a ripoff. Transgalactic, worldwide travel, nature may, pretty in pink. Pool Shark Club, Gaming Ladies, Mohawk, Big Trucks. I like Big Trucks. Guns and Bullets. What does that say? Japanese Cuisine, Military Arms, Taldies. Is that Kappa? <laughs> Marines Team, Movie Guide, Snowboard Guide, and Fit Nest Mag. Good selection. Ramirez. Ramirez, come down into the kitchen. Ramirez, come over here. Oh, okay. Okay, Sergeant Foley, I'm coming. What is it? Ramirez, look. I turn myself into a pickle, Ramirez. Tar inspection. Ooh, he dusts it off. Okay. The tar is top tier in this one. Ooh, intervention. Oh, here we go. This has got to have a cool one. Oh, yeah. Lock and load, baby. I'll donate 30 bucks if you hit a 360 no scope with the intervention. You got it, buddy. Here we go. Ready? Ready? Just like old times. Bang. Didn't get him. 360. Bang. Crap. All right, ready? Ready? 
360. Got one. There we go. 360 no scope. Pay up. <laughs> Whoa. Ah. Whoa. Sorry, BTR. I got a five kill streak. Buy two kids. Me oh, I thought I thought it said buy two kids. It says buy two kids menu. Dude, look at this. You're telling me if you were Ramirez right now, you wouldn't grab one of those burgers and chow down? I totally would. Who cares how long they've been there? I've been living off of MREs, man. Oh, and you got soda? A soda fountain too with every flavor of bub? Don't play the mission loose ends. It's very sad. <laughs> okay, I'll skip that one. All right, all you youngsters, here's a lesson for you. In this mission, you gotta blow up this helicopter. You could use the Virgin Stinger or the Chad LMG. It's as easy as that. They really livened up all these favela missions in this game. It's a lot more green. I like it. The thing I like about this mission is like this guy, like Chemist and uh, Pharaoh, these guys are totally disposable. They can get killed and do get killed very often. And when they die, the game just like spawns in another random TF-141 guy from like around the corner. Like if I kill Pharaoh right now, let me see if I can get him. There we go. So next time I like round a corner and turn around, there'll be a new guy there. He won't be named Pharaoh. He'll have a random name. But it looks similar to Pharaoh. See, there he is. There he is. It's Apex. <laughs> he, just, he just came out of nowhere. Oh, no, he died. Apex already died. <laughs> oh, my God. It's Jester now. See? What the? When did he die? I turn away for one minute and Jester's dead. SMH Jester. Oh, new guy. Who was it? It is Nomad. Oh, and this guy. Coffin. Oh, Thumper. What? When did one of the other guys die? Oh, <laughs> there he is. All right, Thumper. You're up. Akimbo Rangers, you better have a good inspect. Let's see it. Dude, lame. Little known fact, this room is actually based off of the offices of the people that developed the Mirror's Edge. You can tell because there's a can of red paint right here. It's what they use for all the architecture. Jump, jump, jump. Woo! I made it. Dude, I totally made it. Oh, okay. The thing falls this time. In this one, Roche doesn't just suck at jumping. The actual scaffolding, like, falls away. Okay, good change. This part will never not be the coolest part ever. Woo! Here we go. Across the rooftops, baby. Why do you think I referenced Mirror's Edge earlier? How does anybody not make that? Oh. <laughs> I thought I could jump off of the green part. I thought I could jump from like right there, but no, it's from right here. So here we go. Jump. Woo! It's a very far jump. What to see in Portugal? What is, what is there to see in Portugal? I gotta read that. I don't. I know nothing about Portugal. My Portugal knowledge is very slim. What to see in Slovenia, dude? I have no. <laughs> you thought my Portugal knowledge was bad? Uh oh. What have we here? A sports bike parked in the handicap slot. That's a fine. Oh, <laughs> that's what I get for reusing jokes from my last Modern Warfare 2 playthrough. <laughs> what the heck was that? That guy just got by Miss Lord. Bye, Miss Lord. Get out of here. That's the American fantasy, dude. People coming in your house. <laughs> oh, baby. I got some castle doctrine. Look at all this wine. Can you break every individual wine bottle? Oh, boy. Ferb, I know what we're going to do today. Perfect. See, wasn't that satisfying? Fridge guy. Fridge guy. Fridge guy. Fridge guy. Fridge guy. 